Alright guys, welcome back to another video here on the Backlog Gamer Channel. We are playing, um, we are playing, um, Red Dead Redemption 2. when we rob this train too <laughs> yeah I guess we'll see about that oh indeed we will you know he'll come after us oh of course he will just like all the rest but we're gonna stay a step ahead of them make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are we allowed ourselves to get a step behind at Blackwater that won't happen again Yeah, to be based out of Blackwater. Dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Yeah. Riding on the horsey, riding on the horsey. This um, this is where we chase that guy down. Yeah, we're gonna get him. Okay, you got it. Yeah. Go get old Driscoll here. Yeah. Leave me alone. <laughs> ah, shit. No. We're gonna hog tie you, boy. Gonna hog tie you. Yes, you are. Oh, come on. No, can't do that. Let's load him while we're here. I always forget to do that. So, please, please, you don't need to do this. Keep talking. See what that gets you. Oh, Arthur gets Please, mad in a minute. Mister. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. <laughs> oh, God. Please, no. Please, I'll do anything. Just let me go, please. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> it's like Trump when he said that. Wild just got ten feet taller. There we go. I'm gonna check my volume right quick on my. All right, I think it's better. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. That good work, boy. Well, get him, get him off the horse. We got stuff to do with him. Come on. 
Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yeah. <laughs> I got them. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle! Mr. Williamson! Tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. You do that. Let's go to bed. All right, now we can go get the hunting deal taken care of, and then we will um, rob the train. And I think we're out of the mush. <coughs> Starved to death up here, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> we're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. I always get in the crap. Here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, That's you're right. Joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. Yeah. All right. Got a lot of stuff increased there. Okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Oh, watch it. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Yeah, let's do that. <sighs> Been a wild few days, all right. Out right north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. 
Well, Javier told me a bit, but his show weren't good. Oh, man, I love coffee. Mm, it's so good. In this game, I'm just thinking over all the stuff that, that you do in this game. And, um, it's gonna be, uh, there's gonna be a lot of videos just doing the main storyline, I think. You stay quiet. Tell me what to do. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Get the bow. Has deer been here recently? Okay, I need How my bow. I need my bow. From here. You're gonna need the bow. I know I'm trying. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. Let's go hunting for some deer. This is where we learn to track at right here, I think. You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. I'll see him. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. I'm with you. Where'd it go? There it is. See it now. All right. See if we can go catch us a deer. These slow parts of the game, man. Mm. Oh, I see it down there. Yep. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. I'm coming. Try to hit him in the neck or head. I'm trying. Quick and clean. Let me get as close as I can here. Quite hard. You feel when it's too much. Now, Arthur. Good shot. Now let's try for another. All right, let's see where the next one's at. My horse is way far, and I'm gonna walk through this cold butt water right here. Oh my gosh, uh, you know how cold that is in the snow. Bull mess, right there. Is there a deer right here that I'm missing? Oh, that's me. <laughs> oh, I'm a dummy. I know. Oh, here we go. Let's see if we can shoot one of these here. Come on.
We need this meat. Ah, unlucky. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Pick it up. I can't believe I missed that other one. Okay. It just stood there. Like, hey, what's happening here? White tail deer. Yow. Go on, horsey horse. Where's my horse at? Come on. I see him over there. He ain't moving yet. There you are, finally. Take your sweet time getting over here. Come on. Come on. Man, I. Mm. Just thinking about all the animals I got to kill to get my satchel filled up and all that stuff, man. Yep. It's all right, though. We're going to do it. Be able to carry any more. Leave the others. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Easy. Oh, come on. Careful. Come on, Charles. Yeah. Nice You're being crazy brother. now. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Cheer when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. Sure they will. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his <coughs> hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five of the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. Let's get we might up. have family somewhere. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the Odrisco for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Okay. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Well, where are we going? Oh. Wait for me to get out of the way. I see. Cut up here, off the trail.
Calm down, Holtzy. Calm down. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that? But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. I was wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch... You know... Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? <coughs> 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Hmm. Loyalty is a mysterious thing. He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. <laughs> All right, let's get this food to Bill. We can start cooking something. Hold. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Will you do that? Thanks for letting me know. Brought some food back, boys. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. I uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Hmm. Well, I well, well. <clears throat> Just drop it down and... What a surprise. To find a camp rat loitering around hmm. in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you saying it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if well, we do sure. it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, did you dumped on the floor there? Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, 
Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting, after all these years. Yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> Been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of the- You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking, we could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on! What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea, we're living. Look at me. We're living, even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now... Suddenly, we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Yeah, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Alright guys, I'm going to stop the video right here. Uh, thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed the content, please consider subscribing to my channel. Uh, leave me some comments on the videos. Let me know what games you'd like to see me play on this channel. Uh, with that being said, in the next video, I guess we're going to rob a train. So, uh, thanks for watching.